Hi guys, welcome back to another episode of Fingers Crossed. Today's product will be Innisfree Real Hair Makeup Set Edition. So I actually have three products with me as part of the entire set. The first is the Real Hair Makeup Jelly Concealer. The second is the Makeup Tint Brush. And the third is the Makeup Hair Fixer. So I'm going to be trying all three products and today's episode will be a little different in the sense that I'm just going to give my thoughts and opinion as I go along with trying the products. So there will not be like a final part where I like say my thoughts and everything. The entire set together for all three products actually retails for $26 on Hermo. And yeah, here we go! So first up, I'm going to be trying the Makeup Jelly Concealer and it's for your hairline here to kind of conceal that white spot. And you're supposed to use this followed by the Makeup Hairspray to kind of make it set. Kind of like your setting spray, your makeup setting spray. Actually when I first opened it right, it's actually a very squishy kind of cushion because you can just press onto it. And then the product is here. I've already stained my other finger because I was trying it out. So yeah, it's actually really different from other cushions. And now let's see whether it works. I'm just going to try and apply it and cover it. Okay, I definitely checked myself in the mirror already and now it definitely feels like it's working. Just that I haven't really covered the back part of it much but as you can see, as I'm hoping you can see. So I'm gonna try and do that one more time and see how it goes. Okay, first of all for this product, I think this is actually great. I guess this product, even though it conceals like your natural hairline, right? It just helps to make your hair look fuller. So now I'm just gonna apply the makeup fixer. I'm gonna shake it a few times before spraying it. I'm gonna spray it quite far away. Okay, it smells a bit like... I don't know, it doesn't smell awful, it doesn't smell chemical, it just smells kind of fresh actually. The setting spray, I think is for when you're going out and you want to make sure the makeup stays longer. Like, you know, any makeup setting spray, so I think that is just for that. So for the second part of the video, I've actually tied my hair up and I'm going to be using the tin brush. So I'm just going to be drawing on this spot here, which is kind of where my ball spot is. It's so sad, okay, but I'm just going to draw a few lines. This is how it actually draws like and I've drawn a few lines. I don't know if you guys can see, but I'm just I've drawn a few lines and now I'm gonna be using the this side of the brush to just kind of blend it out. So I've kind of blended out already. I will actually draw another line here and then blend it out so then. So let's see how it looks. I think I like the tin brush more. The brush itself has to really target the specific and draw where you really want it to be. And the blending out helps it to make it not so obvious. So I do like that part. Definitely doesn't seem as pigmented or strong as the makeup jelly concealer. But I think that's a good thing because you don't want it to look too fake. I, I, I kind of like the subtleness of it more. I think that's more suited for what I like. I don't like it if like, it's BAM! Like, they just cover one spot. I think the gradual tint to it is actually pretty nice. So comparing this product to the Mamonde Hair Punk Shadow, both the jelly concealer and tint uses a thicker consistency towards compared to powder. So it is easier to build up and to like ensure that it stays in place as well. I feel that this one will just last me much longer compared to a powder product. Thank you guys so much for watching this episode. I hope you guys like it. Please remember to give this video a thumbs up and hit the subscribe button and share this with someone who you feel like, you know, really needs this product it's kind of mean but you know you're helping them in the end anyway and i'll see you guys in the next one bye